or I am headed to the 10K. The day has come. Time to run the 10K. And there's people out and about. Very seldom do you see so much activity at four o'clock in the morning at Epcot. There are a lot of cars here already. Tons. This side of Epcot is almost, parking lot looks pretty full. But I'm guessing 90% of these cars are probably single riders. So it takes a lot more cars. Here must be like the runner's village or something. That's what I'm gonna call it for now until they tell me different. They do have the music bumping, trying to get everybody awake because it is 4.30 in the morning. Okay, today we are getting ready for the race. We're all here. Uh, Jeff, Corey, Steve, Bloopers Sam, next year. Zip, and Nicole's back there. What did he do? There was a blooper. I forgot to push the record button. So he, he did a whole intro, and this is actually intro number two. Two, yes. It is early. So technically... Somebody give me coffee. Right there. So everybody gets a corral number, A through F. And we are E, no, we are actually C, but Corey is E, so we are able to drop down to run with Corey, so we all get to run together. So as you can see, these balloons here, and this one's pretty bright, there'll be the light behind it. And here's another one, so there's, each of these are corrals, you go into your corral, and then they uh, send you off like a herd of cows once they're ready to go. So I did it all wrong. This gentleman right here, when he gets thirsty, he brought his own plate. We did it all wrong. He's got his wine and everything. I love it. That is awesome. Now that's preparation. together and cut people off and they send another group in the front so they're sending off everybody in different chunks the crowds are not even cut off between each other so it's not too large of a group So we are at the end of our corral and we are patiently waiting. It is a half an hour since the first groups have taken off. But this is how they do it. This is how they separate everybody.
We are going through this. Honestly, thought you were going to record. That's exactly what we're going to do. We're going strong. <laughs> we're point. almost there. We just started, but we're almost done. Yes. We're almost there to point three miles. About to cross point, point three. <laughs> so we're about uh, uh, four tenths of a mile just away. Just a little snow. Maybe an actual that snowman on us. You promise? Promise. That's not fair. I don't have any pinkies right now. Oh, they're going snow. Think of that snowman that we could build with all of our new friends. Sounds amazing. So we ran through the Epcot entrance. Here is the people we're running with right here. Oh, and way no. over there on the road, you can see the people. Right. We need to walk, no, walk up the rest. Walk up and run down. It's a beautiful morning to be running. Mid 60s. Very, very nice day. So we've gone one mile. Oh, yeah. Here's a turn. And there's a character up ahead. It's Mad Hatter. Mad Hatter. So that was a picture stop for the Mad Hatter. Pretty long line. Mine's too big. So there's more people. We were Corral E. So this is probably Corral F. We are up on top of a hill on the road. As you can see, all these lanes are coming. And then there's the ball in the back. Some more entertainment. Mickey is looking for his two hands. We found them. Mickey, we found your hands. So we're coming up on mile marker to Just ran, or Megan ran. Like, Meg ran like, into wow, us. That guy's kind of we tall. know this. We're in the purple shirt, kind of like Steve. Meg, wait, wait, wait. Oh. I love it. Yes. Hey, get, get here, Dale. Get here, Dale. Hurry, hurry, hurry. So they took us out and around, and then we end up coming back to the place where we checked in and started, and we're heading to the park now. Everybody's doing great. It's been a great morning. It's been a great morning. So, over there, if you can see, is Guardians of the Galaxy. The new ride. We're all rocking it. So we're getting up on the three mile marker and it is Mickey stopping for pictures so if we would have ran the 5k here's the marker we'd be done came around the we came around the curve after the 5k marker they take us to the right 
and you can see we're headed to Epcot yeah. to gone. test track. Yeah. Taking a little break, yeah. walking a little bit. We're good to go. So, here we come. Where are they? Oh, are you guys? Yeah. Sorry. You got a little horizon there. Here we come in the Epcot. Coming right in the Epcot. And I believe, yep, right between Norway and China. Check it out. We made it. This is cool. <laughs> There's China. We made it, Dale. That's awesome. In yes. Not too sure who sounds better. Chef and uh, Corey or Disney? Here we go. Over here's Pinocchio. I'll walk with you, Steve. Here's an empty Japan. So there's a long line for whoever this character is. We are about to find out. Oh, it's a boo! Oh, Check it out, you don't see him around the parks. It's a boo! Sorry, Dale, you're good. Four miles in! Beautiful view. Epcot with only runners. What a morning. Six, two miles left, Check out the sunrise. Left. Check out the sunrise. We're two thirds of the way done. Oh, Can't yeah. see the sun oh, much. Hey, wait, 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 wait. Can't see the sun much, but hey. the colors are awesome. So we are leaving Epcot. Going to boardwalk. And the Skyliners are in full motion this morning. Oh, congestion! Picture? So here we are running into Boardwalk. People on the other side have gone all the way around and they are leaving Boardwalk. Funneling into the Boardwalk. Yes, Boardwalk. Goofy. Oh, racing. There's our dude. Love Goofy. Guys, we're doing great. Go it, guys. <laughs> Up here, we got Donald. Sorry, 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 sorry. Oops, sorry, Steve. Go back there. Let's go take pictures. Coming up on the five mile marker. Makes everything seem So we just went around the boardwalk. Yeah, we We're coming into 
the back entrance again into Epcot. Actually, they're taking us around past the Skyliners. Coming back into Epcot, they bring us in over by the Kingdom. It's about one more mile from here. It's about one more mile. So we're exiting again right next to Mexico and headed back to where it all began. Right here, coming up to mile six with Nemo and Dory. guys so i hope you enjoyed checking out the 10k run that dale and the guys did it was um, a lot of fun it was awesome putting it together and uh, checking out how much fun you guys yeah had. i haven't seen it actually jenna put it together she said it looked good mm -hmm. and she's the expert well so <laughs> We'll go with what she says. Yeah, well, and just a huge thanks to Dale for filming while he was running. I mean, running a 10K and filming, I, I couldn't even ran it. So good job. <laughs> with the GoPro and the phone. Yeah, he had both. Yeah, you could kind of see him every once in a while in the in the shots that we got, the clips. But um, big congrats to Dale Here's, and the guys. There's the medal. There's the medal. It's very cool. Oswald. So cool. Focus. Yep, there's the medal with Oswald. I love it. And you can see it. It's pretty heavy. Sort of, yes. Heavy duty. Sort of see it uh, as far as the little 3D there action. It's there awesome. you go. <laughs> 
Dale said it was pretty heavy. Too. Yes, it, like it's wearing. very cool. Yep, very cool ribbon. Mm -hmm. And then also, since we ran Give Kids the World, we got a medal ran from for them. You didn't run. Yeah, them. yeah, we didn't run Give Kids the World. <laughs> <laughs> we ran for. There you go. We were sponsored by essentially yes. for Give Kids the World, and it was a lot of fun doing that as well. They're a great organization uh, here in the Orlando area. But then they gave us a medal as well. And uh, so let's cool. see. So we got two medals, and it's a thank you. And they have a, I'm not sure if it's sort of a competition or not, but they have uh, uh, somebody from Give Kids the World design it. Some kids, the, yeah. Some kids. Actual kids. And actual kids from Give Kids the World design it. And then they pick one of the designs. And this year it was Megan, age 10. Her design was selected for the medal. So that was very cool as well. Mm -hmm. So we had two medals, and as we were walking around, it was like this. <laughs> and nobody else had that. Like, we were That's cool. We were the cool dudes. Uh, of course you were. <laughs> so, yeah, Dale ran so, yes. with um, our good friend Corey from Corey, Corey Meets, Meets World. World and the Dis and That guys. So you have uh, Dave. No, he didn't run. Dave didn't run. We, he's part of the Dis and That. Right? Dave from Brandy and Dave. He didn't run, though. He didn't run. Um, Shep ran from the Shep family. Yep. Steve ran from Steve's World. And then also, they ran, the four of us ran together, but then also uh, Zip ran from zippity doodad yeah he was here with his wife nicole they ran as well yeah uh, and they ran by themselves and we all finished it was a lot of fun it looked a really lot cool and now i want to do one i'm yes. thinking 5k though mm -hmm. uh, to start out with and uh yeah so we'll see you guys have to oh and these tuned. were the shirts because when we ran yeah. we had the purple shirts which were given to us by give kids the world but these were the official 10k ones those are so cool each race obviously they had their different and their own uh, individual logo or whoever the character was, but this was the uh, oh yeah on the sleeve, which is pretty cool for Epcot. Yeah. So yeah, this was the official running shirt. I'm not. Oh too look, he's holding the medal. I love it, Oswald. <laughs> yeah, Oswald's okay. got a medal. I'm not too sure why they went with long sleeves. Well, I normally prefer... it's chillier in January here. Chillier. True, but now I might have to cut the sleeves so I can wear it here in Florida. Oh, you can wear it in the winter. <laughs> in order to do, in order to wear it in the winter, I still need to cut the sleeves. No, no we'll see. <laughs> so, so, anyways, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, leave a comment down below if you've ever ran a Run Disney event before. Um, let us know which one you've done: 5K, 10K, half, full. Um, yeah, and a lot of people do the Dopey Challenge. And what's the other one called when you do the half and the full? Goofy. Goofy the Challenge. Goofy Challenge. Okay. And you don't have a lot of people. They they walk majority of it. So even if you don't want to run or so, you can even walk. Even the half and the full? Well, maybe not the half, yeah. but like the 5K and the 10K, just to do one, sign up for the 5K. Mm -hmm. And you can literally walk most of it and be able to get your medal. Yeah. And it is a lot of fun to be able to see the park with the extra music. And then they have characters out, Yeah. as you saw as well in the video. And you got to that, see Sunrise at Disney, yeah. which you don't get to see very no, often. So. No, very cool. Very, very cool. Uh, give us a thumbs up if you like this video. And make sure you're subscribed if you haven't already. And check out our sponsors, mickeyblog.com and mickeytravels.com for the best in free Disney planning advice. And also, Victor Naraki. He is a realtor here in Central Florida. If you've ever dreamed about living near the magic, check him out at celebratingflorida.com or facebook.com slash Naraki Realtor. Make sure you tell him Resort TV One sent you. And if you want to save money for your next Disney vacation, check out cordcuttersnews.com. They can help you save money on your cable bill. Check him out at cordcuttersnews.com or youtube.com slash cordcuttersnews. So for now, have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye-bye. Now that you've finished watching this video, be sure that you're subscribed so that you can get all of the latest updates. Also, check out some other great videos on our channel. Have a great big beautiful tomorrow. Bye-bye.